Um, yeah, it, it wasn't the best. Um, I've been trying to work on executing races and training because um, kind of all indoors I've been struggling um, executing. Um, but today, today was a bit better. The time didn't kind of show that, but I don't know. Today, I think today was just kind of about having fun and just experiencing it and learning off it, really. So I think I, I, I learned a lot from that, so yeah. Good. And what is next for you? Um, well, I've got the outdoor time for the European indoors. And I finished second last week, so hopefully I should be able to go to European in indoors now. And um, yeah, just get, get get a good three weeks training in, two weeks training, I think. Sorry, and then uh, yeah, just prepare for that. Hopefully, run a bit better. And today, how did you find today on a whole? Yeah, it was great. The yeah, the crowd's amazing. It's just like when you walk out and you just look, you're like, whoa, kind of thing. But yeah, it's cool. It's just it's just just good to experience it. Really, I'm just glad to be here. Good. Yeah. So last year was a massive year for you. But how do you prepare? How's the preparations gone for the indoor season? and Beijing outdoor season, how's that going? Um, yes, well, um, kind of um, winter training didn't go ideal. Uh, my coach um, quit coaching me, so okay. it's kind of left without a coach. Sorry. Luckily, um, Matt Elias kind of stepped in and helped me out. He's a great guy. Yeah, yeah, great guy and helped me out. So um, uh, now I'm going to be relocating to Loughborough in March and um, okay. starting there. But um, yeah, I mean, like, things have been going well. Um, and my training hasn't changed and stuff, but it's just, I think it's been a bit mentally kind of thing. But. I don't know, just, just trying to progress, yeah. Brilliant. Well, congratulations and good luck at the European Indoors. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks for talking to us. <laughs>